normal map tools. This is how to install the NVIDIA normal map generator or GIMP. Okay, so this is this is something that happens all the time. I teach a texture rendering and lighting course, and uh, this seems to be a problem. I don't know what it, why, but it is. So here's why. Uh, first off, the student gets confused if they own a 32-bit or a 64-bit operating system. So let's go over that together real quick. If you go to my computer and you go to C drive, you'll find that a program files 86 directory. So if you see this x86, you have a 64-bit operating system. Okay. If you only see program files, you have a 32-bit operating system. Now, here's the kicker. If you own a 64-bit operating system, it doesn't matter which plugin you use. Because when you go into here, you'll see there's an Adobe, and then there's Photoshop. Okay, And look, there's another place for Photoshop. It's under Program Files 86, where you will also find an Adobe and also a Photoshop. Okay. Now, here's the easy way to do it. If you're unsure still, get the 32-bit version and then live life complacently. So where did I find this? Well, here's how you do it. Go to Google. Type in NVIDIA Space normal map filter. Okay. Go to the topmost link. It should be like developer.nvidia.com. And here it is. You could download a 32 or 64. Again, if you're unsure, 32 bits your way to go. Save it. Save it onto your hard drive somewhere. Yes. Now, unfortunately, I can't reinstall this. Because um, I've installed it already, if I reinstall it, it will delete it and then reinstall it back. See, a version is already existing. In order to set up, you have to uninstall it. So I do not want to uninstall it. Trust me when I say this. If you click Next, OK, Continue, or anything above the uh, provided adjective, you should be OK. All right? Now... Let's go over to Photoshop. So program files, Photoshop. There's a 64 bits one. I installed the 32 bit. So here's a little quiz. Where is it? It's right. It's in the other program files. <laughs> so Pro Adobe, Photoshop, and then launch Photoshop. I would launch it like this only because most cases you don't know where this is going. See, this one's a 64-bit one. So launch it by going into Program Files until you get used to it. You can see this one doesn't say 64-bit at all. And under Filter, if you did it right, you should have NVIDIA tools. Again, if you if you think you got it wrong, you know, try the other Photoshop, see if NVIDIA exists. All right. As an option for people that have Mac, they can install GIMP. GIMP has a normal map filter in it. But if you own a Mac computer, you're going to have to download this, the actual plugin separately. So if you don't know what GIMP is, GIMP is a Photoshop clone for open source. You can find it typing in GIMP. I think it's like GIMP.org. So here it is. And you can download it by going into Downloads and English. Once you install this onto your system, you're going to have to go to one more place if you own a Mac computer. Okay, Normal Map GIMP plugin. Type that in Google. 
And you're going to go into the topmost link, I think. Should be able to. So code.google.normalmap. Okay, code.google.com. Let me write this down so you have it. That is the URL that you're going to. Okay. Then you're going to go to download section. And they should have the download right here. It's the zip file. And you'll uh, download this and unzip it. Now, there is instructions in it. They are in plain English, so please read over them very carefully. Since I am on a PC computer, I cannot go over the instructions and have them physically make sense to you. So you read those directions very carefully and you should be good to go. It's how to install the NVIDIA Normal Map filter. So here, if you launch GIMP, GIMP. If done correctly, it should look like this. Let's say I just have a new whatever. And if I go to filters, map, I should have a normal map there. All right. So that is how to install the NVIDIA normal map generator through Photoshop or as an option for GIMP if you have a Mac computer. If you have a PC, I think it's already installed for you. You don't have to manually install that plugin. Happy normal mapping. Enjoy.